All right, Serpy Moose 99. Pig timer is set. We've got fresh coffee. And um, Grumpy Gnome has issued a challenge back to the same group. Grumpy Gnome has challenged me, Evolution SE, Midnighter, and Moostro, and anybody else that wants to do, to a Halloween challenge. So this is the map type. Should be interesting. Never done this before. And the catch here, and I think this is kind of an interesting one, is we can only use five theme sets. So we can only use the witch's theme set, which makes sense. We can only use the friendly pumpkins theme set. And we can only use gothic, druidic here, and the forest haven set, which is over here. Now, I've never used any of those sets before, so this should be interesting, but... If the building's not in one of those five sets, we can't use it. So, I don't exactly know yet what's in there. I had a little look around, but it, it'll be interesting here. So, we've got an Adam and Eve start here. And we don't have a lot of land to work with, so... I'm just going to have a little look through here. I think there was a gather in... There's a gather in one of these things here. I'm just going to have a quick look through. Just to see what's here. It was herbalist for sure. Oh, there's a gather. Okay, that's a pretty big radius too. Okay, I think I'm actually going to plunk that down. Okay, we'll do a little force note or something here. Now it's out of an eve, so we do have... Um, Apple, firewood, hide, boat, iron tools. Okay, so the gatherer is going to be good, I think, for our food. And we have a coven storage here, capacity 1100. And a coven shed, capacity 4000. And a witch's hoard. Okay, interesting. Well, the shed is 26 logs. The witch's hoard is two well i think we're going for the witch's hoard to start with here okay let's plunk that down there and we're going to need a stockpile And we'll do a little stockpile there. And let's get our usual heads up display here. And our job jar here. Okay. Now, I'm hoping there's a nomad thing in here somewhere. Okay, and we'll go up to 10 times here. And let's make sure our camera's set here. Good. Okay, let's go, guys. Okay, stockpile's in. Now, I would like to grab some trees from outside our gatherer here, but... We've got a little bit of food and stuff, so this is not quite as desperate as Jack and Jill. So let's get him to do a stockpile over there. In fact, we've got four logs in stock here. Okay, so that stockpile is built. And just building it caused to gather a few logs here so we need 16 logs for that and two for the storage so let's just do a little teeny bit out here well it's probably more than a little teeny bit but we'll do that Alright, now I don't have a spooky voice, so you just have to imagine some Halloween theme music or something. 
I don't actually know how to import music into a video, so I should probably look into that. Change the soundtrack here. That would be kind of cool. All right, we have quite a few logs now. So I think it's time we built our witch's horde and our gatherer here. So I'm going to make both of them a builder. And I'm going to drink some coffee. Oh, let me know if this new camera angle works better or if you're looking up my nose or something gross like that. I rearranged things a little bit here, so. All right, there's our gatherer. Now, I'm going to put a person in there. And if I actually click the right thing here. And I'm going to fix our food limit. Now, can we see what this thing looks like in here? It's got like a little witch's hat thing going on there. <laughs> okay, and the witch's horde is a wagon. Okay. Interesting. Now I've built the wrong thing though, because the witch's horde is actually, looks like it's actually a little market or something here. So let's go back into our theme sets here. Okay, it does say same as a market, storage is 1200. We have Coven Hall, cool. Okay, I'm actually going to have to build this, so... Hmm. Oh well, off to a good start here, Grumpy. Oh, that's too big, I think. The shed, maybe. Okay, and that would fit where that thing is, so... Well, let's call that the first derp here. And I'm going to have to take the person out of... Wow, we have 248 food. That's a ton. Let's just take that person out of there for the moment. And let's de-derp here. Now we have 25 logs. Okay, now let's see what that... Uh, Get the right one here. So we're going to go shed, I think, right there. Okay, 26 logs. We have 25. So, you know, it's close, right? So let's designate a few more trees here. Well, let's maybe temporarily cut those two down right in front of there so we can take a better look at that. Okay, so let's do a priority like so. Follow them around here. Hmm. Terrain's interesting. The stockpiles just kind of blend into the ground here. Let's see. Still got a bit of food, still got a bit of firewood, okay. I'm recording this really early in the morning, so if I fall asleep, don't be too surprised here. That's probably why I'm drinking 400 gallons of coffee here. All right, guys, build the shed. Simon says, build the shed here. And while they're doing that, I don't think there was a forester in any of that. We got the gather, we got some storage, we got... Oh, cool. That's a town hall. Um, so let's go in 
Let's see the friendly pumpkin set. Okay, there's our shed built. So we'll put somebody back into the gatherer here. And we need to get a bit of a wood cutting thing going on, but maybe we should, uh, while we're doing the menu hunt, let's get some more trees chopped over here. Maybe we'll go down to five while we're hunting around in the menu here. So friendly pumpkin. I tried not to prep too much for this. I wanted to kind of explore and just kind of see what's in these menus and everybody can get an idea of what we're up against here. Hmm. It's friendly storage. Um, I like that set though. What's in the forest haven here? Forest platform. Oh, that's like an elven kind of thing going on there. Ground houses. Oh, we got traders in there. That's good. We got a bridge, which is really good. Resources. Here we go. We got a woodcutter. We got workshops. Nut heaven. Nut roaster. And log supply. Oh, that must be like storage or something. Branch gatherer, forester. There's a gatherer there. Smaller gathering circle though. And a fisherman, that's good to know. Okay, so we're gonna want the woodcutter. And we'll put that right there. So I think that's the next thing we gotta build. And we also need a house. I think that would be a grand idea here. So we need to find. Okay, that looks like a friendly house for five people, 18 logs and four stone. That seems pretty reasonable. Let's see here. A witch's house is 28 logs for five people. Okay. And I'm going to put that opposite the stockpile here. And we're early autumn, so I might have killed this already here. Interesting. It's always good to kill your people in the early months uh, of the year. So we got a fair amount of logs to go there. I think we need to get um, the house built and then the wood chopper because we do have some firewood here. All right, so not that I'm panicking or anything, but I think we need to get on with that one. And a few more logs there. That's cool. All right, we have enough to build it. You have to remember you're a builder there. Let's make them both builders so there's no confusion about what's priority here. All right, so there we go. Okay, my eyes are failing here, but uh, there we go. And let's see what the house looks like here. It's kind of got that haunted house vibe to it. All right, now we need to get this wood chopper going. So I'm gonna do the same thing and I'll leave them both as builders.
The only thing we have in our barn is water thatch, which is cool. Now, as soon as we get this woodcutter going, we need to get somebody back into the gathering hut, I think, here. We have enough firewood to get through the winter, I'm pretty sure, but... So I think once this builds, we'll put somebody in the gatherer hut. And... We'll leave one as a laborer. Okay, and now that you've got a house, we need to get on with the baby business there, guys. And the woodcutter can be off for the moment, I think. And logs would be the idea. There's a fair amount still designated in there. And let's pick up some stone too. So while they're doing that, let's explore a little more here. So we got Gothic Fantasy, Dark Hostel, it's kind of a keep looking thing, small tower. Oh, I like those houses, at least from the back anyways, there's a school, keep, Cathedral of the Wicked. <laughs> Well, I gotta say, Grumpy, you picked a good set here. Yeah, that's decorations. Okay, so that was Gothic. And Forest Haven was the other one we were looking at here. Eight different houses, that platform we looked at. There's a barn, traders. You know what I'm not seeing in here? I'm not seeing mines. Hunter's Cabin. No, we do have a Hunter's Cabin. Oh, cool. It's got a big circle or a biggish circle, but it only costs one log. Used to define an area for hunting wild game. Okay, so basically. It's a school, a church, and hunting cabins, okay? Interesting. So primarily we're going to be working out of here, I would think. And I'm going to do as much of the witch's stuff as we can. Alright. Got a bit of an idea what's going on here, but looks like to me, iron is going to be a bit of a problem here. Okay. Hmm. So we're going to have to get a trader going, I think is the plan here. And we're going to run out of tools pretty soon. Okay, I think I get an idea what's going on here. So our food is up to 500-ish and... Okay, I think I'm going to take the gatherer out, put a little bit of wood chopping in here. And what happened there? Okay. Oh, I've done something goofy here. Let's go look at the big job jar here. I've got a woodcutter. And I've got a gather. Oh. <laughs> I turned the gather off, not take the gather out. Do what I say, not what I derp. Okay. Now we got a decent amount of resources here. I'm actually going to think about... Let's gather up a little bit of iron ore here.
Now, actually there's a little bit some, like that much here, and let's make that a priority. Let's look through here now. If we could use everything, we could find a blacksmith. Well, the basic blacksmith will do um, tools out of iron ore. But I'm wondering... We've got this guy, the friendly smith here. And I don't think there was a smith in there. Definitely wasn't in the druidic. And we have a small smith there. Okay, so let's build the small smith out of the... Hmm. Pick the right spot here. The small smith out of this is out of the gothic set. And let's see what recipes we have there. Okay, so there was a smith in there, and there was a smith in the friendly pumpkin set. Okay. It's going to be a little bit of exploration here, but that's cool. I've never used these theme sets before, so. Now, I don't think we need any more firewood than that. And our food's still good, so let's put a builder in. And let's get this thing built here. And I think the other thing to do, to do looking at this terrain here, there's a big expand area there. And then a little bit down here, so... We're not going to be able to grow this super huge, but that's okay. It's more about exploring the different theme sets here. Which I want to do more and more of here. I've been poking in here a little bit, but there's a lot of material in here. Okay, now if this smith doesn't have an iron ore formula, I'm going to build the other one, but I'll keep both of them, I'm not going to destroy it. We're not that short of resources yet here. Alright, so let's have a look at here. Wooden tools, stone tools, rough tools. Okay, this, this one will work then. Okay, we're down to two tools, so I'm going to put somebody in here. Let's take the builder out. And let's see if we can get, say, a stockpile of... Oh, we have lots of logs. Let's try and get 25 rough tools here. Now, while that's going on, back into our theme sets here. Now, the witch... Okay, I have to remember which is which here. This is a Forest Haven one. Okay, that's the one with the trader. And it does have a forester. Okay, and it looks like that. Hmm. Maybe I'm going to build that out to the side over here. Let's build it in line. I'm trying to figure out a spot where sort of away from our houses a little bit here I think that's going to work there alright so we have enough logs to build that food's okay firewood's okay our tools are climbing there we go well that worked pretty good let's put a builder in and let's build this forester here wherever it went there. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Still got some of the original stuff there. That's kind of cool. Looks like this shed doesn't have much capacity, so I have to keep that in mind too. How are we doing on our build over here? I'm just about to come up here. Okay, let's make them both builders for the moment here. Oh, there was a child born. I didn't even notice. There we go. And I'm gonna turn this off for the moment. Okay. So Derpy, why are you building all these buildings and turning them off? Well, it's Adam and Eve. So food is not super high. All right, so we'll have one, one gatherer here and one laborer. And we can do a collect almost all the things here. So let's clear out this area. It's gonna take a while, I know there's only one person working on it. Let's put a little stockpile down here. Alright, let's uh, let's let that one run for a while here. Okay, I'm Adam and Eve, so I am gonna save scum if uh, one of them dies for some goofy reason, so I'll just save that off. And again, let's go back into our menus here. So friendly pumpkin. Doesn't that sound like fun? Build some friendly houses. So I usually do like a uniform build here, but why don't we kind of build like one house out of each of the sets here and then kind of check them out okay and then forest haven that had houses too haven house i gotta say it was kind of supposed to be a spooky theme but we've got all these things like haven house friendly house it's all kind of cool Although we do have the dark stuff, I'm sure, here in the gothic set here. Cathedral of the Wicked. I usually don't build churches, but we're building that one. Okay. Now, I did somewhere in here a small bridge here. This sounds like a really cool idea. Okay. Except I need you to be a big grown-up bridge, not a small bridge like that. Well, that's going to be an issue because if that's the only bridge we got, we're not going anywhere. I don't think you can build that in two sections, right? <laughs> Alright, I might have to do a little cheese here. Just a little bit of cheese. Because I do have my power flattening tool. Hmm. Well, let's go through this again, so. Those are fences. Okay. Small bridge is going to get me across the stream, but not across... The trade river there and you have nothing okay well I might have to consult with grumpy gnome here because we're not gonna go anywhere with that so we might be limited to this area here what about down here oh we can go down there okay well we're not expanding up into there too bad that was a nice friendly area up there. Okay, well, so be it. So be it here. So, tools are still 25. Firewood's still okay. Food's really good, okay. So, let's take the gatherer out and just have two laborers while we're doing the cleanup here. 
How much do we actually have left to do? Let's give that a go there, guys. All right, oh, except for Jane is about to require a house here. Now, I'm pretty sure the witch's house said it had a capacity of five here. I took, um, yeah, witch's house. Five people, okay, so there's not a super rush. But let's see what a friendly house looks like here. Three by four house for five people. Oh, I see different styles, okay. That's nice to get a choice like that. I think that one looked okay to me, though. Yeah, I should have put our street kind of the other way around, but... Well, I'm going to line it up with the back there. Alright, so we'll build that for Jane there. Okay, I think we better get some... No man's going here. So I'm just going to... Yeah, I'll let them clear stuff. a town hall and it's kind of not really fitting with what we've got right now okay and in here okay that's a market in the trees which does sound kind of cool and resources Tools and clothes, okay. Not Haven, I gotta build me one of those for sure. <laughs> and... I'm kinda looking for something that might attract nomads here. I think we're gonna have to build... We have to build one of the town halls, I think, here. Nutty extras. Oh, a scarecrow for nomads. Two percent, ten percent, hundred percent. Well, what could go wrong with a scarecrow for a hundred percent nomads? I'm going to put him here in between the stockpile. Okay. And our wood chopper. Can't see him too good there, but a little scarecrow in there. I wonder if we can get rid of some of these flowers here. Collect flowers here. I thought there'd be more there from what I was seeing. Oh, maybe that's fodder that's going on there. Like fodder here. Yeah, okay. Let's clear that stuff out there. And our scarecrow. Okay, so we're not going to go 100% for all that long, but let's get some people happening here. Okay, Jane has grown up, so let's put a builder in, maybe two. And we're probably going to have to chop a little bit of firewood after we build this house here. It's a friendly house. Okay, cool. Now I assume the nomads are going to come in the spring. So we have two builders. Let's go back to... 
put a gatherer back in. Let's do a little wood chop in here. And I think we can actually... Oh, storage check here. Let's put somebody in the forester here. Just planting for the moment. Okay, we'll chop a little bit of wood. I'm going to up this to 300, so let's lay in a store there. And then I thought I saw a small, um, what do you call it, um, shared, shared dwelling domus. <laughs> oh man. And that was a small house here. Tree houses here. Oh, interesting. Forest topper. Oh, no, that's wild. <laughs> forest topper, too, and that was from the Forest Haven set, okay. Treehouse for four people, treehouse for four people. Okay. But I think in the witches here... Oh, that's for the records, okay. School storage here. I thought I saw like a boarding house equivalent in here somewhere. Hmm. I wonder if we want to build one of these hunting cabins here. Oh, they're different sizes, okay. Druid Witch Hut. And heal, okay. Well, why don't we do a hunting cabin here? Why don't we put that out with... Or even further out here. I don't know if I was ever going to put a road in and be along here. Let's do that with a hunting cabin. Uh, we have nomads. Okay, cool. Now our food is over a thousand. Our firewood's up to 300. Um, note to self, we can take out the woodcutter. I think we're good to go on these nomads here, so let's find our scarecrow. Okay, we just doubled our population. All right, now at least this was six adults here, so we need at least one house, okay? So that house is from the witch's house. That is from the friendly pumpkin set. Um, let's go into Forest Haven here. I think we got to build one of these tree houses here. Okay, that was number one. That's number two. That's number three. Oh, I like that one. Four is top for four. Okay, 24 logs, which we have. And so that was Forest Haven, Friendly Pumpkin, Witches. I don't think the Druidic set had a house. No. So let's go into the gothic set here. Oh, there we go. That's what I was remembering. Dark hostel for four families of five people. Okay. A dark tower. Okay. I'll put that in there. Can be a house for the forester and the hunter there. Small tower. That's a lot of stone, though. Ah, we got it. 
All right, let's put a couple of builders in. Maybe even three. And let's pause the hunting cabin, I think. And let's get these two houses built. Um, as soon as the houses build, I think we better up our gatherers and build that hunting cabin. Interesting, okay. And we're out of tools. Happy day, okay, so I guess we can't be out of tools. You just haven't grabbed them. Or did I do something dumb like shut off the path to the uh, to the blacksmith here? Might have. I don't know, that's okay. Let's actually put our road in so we actually can say we're actually civilized. Okay, so what the heck happened there? Oh, were those nomads in some kind of goofy spot? Let's go see. Okay, so that must be what happened. We just had the bugged out nomad problem. Okay, because we have food and we have tools and everybody just died of starvation and they had no tools, so... Alrighty. That would be the nomad bug, so... We don't actually have double the population. <laughs> oh dear. Well, Jane was married long enough to have a child anyways. <laughs> I, uh... So there's... So she probably briefly married a nomad that was... Yeah, never mind. I'm not going to ask, and let's just see where our people are. we got a gatherer going. Don't actually need it at the moment. We have lots of wood. Let's just go a labor and builder here. And we don't really need to build these, do we, at this moment? So let's pause it. The small tower is paused. And let's at least bring the material. So we'll take the builder actually out. Okay, so next time we get nomads, I'm actually going to save before I click accept. And we'll just see where they are. I don't like killing bannies, even if they are just pixels or whatever. Okay, and we'll pause that. It's a big tree house, that one. All right, now. Food is okay. Fire was okay. Do we still have somebody in the forest, or we do? Let's uh, put a second person in the forest here. And get some planting going on. Now, normally I'd nuke this storage cart over here. But I don't really think there's a big reason to at the moment, so let's not do that. Um, let's bring the logs for the hunting cabin. Alright, um, co 
oats are the other thing, but we don't really have... Okay, once a hunting cabin builds, I want, I want, I want, I want, I want some kind of town hall. Dark town hall. What does that look like? Eh, it's a little bit too castly for me. Yeah. Okay, so that's a tower. It doesn't look too bad. I know. Well, we'll put if we put it beside that, probably more properly, we should put it up there. And I think the witches had a coven hall for records here. Well, I'm gonna put that in now. Where our trading dock will probably be up in here. Alright, so let's put this by the stockpile here. I actually want to build that because I want to see what's going on. Okay, so we need to take a forester out for the moment and become a builder. Let's build the hunting cabin first here. Now, if we actually get nomads that survive the arrival here, I'm going to pause the coven hall because we're out of logs for the moment. Okay, the hunter's done. We don't have a gather. We don't have any food production at the moment. Okay, let's go two laborers and let's get us some logs going on here. Oh, and we've got nomads again. Okay. Now I'm going to save here, and if, like I say, if there's somewhere where they're going to die, I'm going to reload. I think this is going to be a reload. I don't see any nomads here. So let's accept them. Okay. Oh, I got to click on the scarecrow. Accept them. Unpause, and let's go see where these guys are. So you're across the river here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, let's do a little bit of cheese. I know this is a challenge, I might be getting myself in trouble here, but let's go into here. There was a small bridge here. And it's just short, so... If I was the power level... That. And this is just for the sake of, um of um, public service, right? Okay, so back in here. Okay, that looks like me, that's cheese, okay. Now, what do we have? Oh, I wonder if they can work to help themselves. That'll be interesting here. So, let's put down... Let's do a stockpile right there. A little even 3x3. Three three. And this part has a stockpile and the bridge here. Now, do I have anything that's not on pause here okay and let's actually see what happens here see if we can save them okay so you're over there what you really need to do is run over here 
and build a bridge. That's what you really need to do. And you need to do it before you die. Okay. Don't wander around in the forest. You want to build the stockpile and then build the bridge. That's what you want to do. Okay, and we need a few more logs, guys. Okay, I don't know if this is going to be in time here. And I think, sadly, the kids are over there. Come on, come on, come on, build that bridge. Don't stop now, don't stop now. Okay, everybody's a builder. No exceptions. Alrighty. Now. Run. 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 Oh, come on, kids. Come on. Oh, don't starve. Don't starve. Oh, you got something out of the storage cart. Oh, man. Okay. That was a little too much stress for me. Let's put two people gathering. Two people hunting. Um, back in the forester here. Two people planting. And we have a few tools. So we're okay there. Firewood's okay, but now we need to build. Okay. So, Grumpy, if I did bad there with that little... She's terraforming, let me know. But I think in this case it had to be done to save those nomads here. And the small tower. Okay. So let's get those houses built. All the resources are there, so... Okay. It's a little more desperate than what I wanted. Okay, no, I don't want another hundred here, so let's get rid of that. And I have to remember what theme set those were in. And... Oh dear. It's a scarecrow, right? So it was witches, I think. You know, those are houses. Okay, maybe it was Friendly Pumpkin then. Okay, must take notes next time we find something cool. Alright, I'll have to look for it again. But I think we should put it back maybe at like a 10% or something a little bit lower. But 100% seemed to work, and we were lucky we saved them there. Alright, so... One more house there. Okay, so that's a witch's house, a friendly pumpkin. And that was from the forest haven, the tree house. And that's from the gothic set, okay. Well, let's try another one from the Forest Haven set here. So that was Forest Haven 4. That's a little too bushy for me. What does 2 look like? That's even worse. Um, That's similar and it's got the ladder and everything. 
Maybe I can go for that one. All right, build this up here. Okay, the pig timer is almost about to go off here. So let's get that house built here. Get everybody in a home. Our food is uh, struggling a little bit here. So I feel like next episode we're going to have to deal with food. And I do want this uh, coven hall coming up as well too. Okay. It's a really good spot for a fisher fishing dock over there. I was going to build trade docks in this flat section here, but I can do it up there. Now, somebody in here had a fishing dock, I think. Not gothic, maybe this one here. Uh, resources, okay. Fisherman. Fisher person. Um, ooh, that's pretty good for water right there. Alright, so I'm gonna get rid of this. Um, the fisherman and some storage. And then we have to end because the pig timer has spoken. And a small barn. I think we'll use the same set there. So, where was that fisherman there? Small barn. Oh, there's a stockpile there. Okay. All right, let's end the episode here. But that was the Halloween challenge, episode one, and I am Derpy Moose ninety nine. Take care.